Jack Hermanson or this guy, they've all taken it to the next level over the last several years. Yes, it's unbelievable to watch him take control and find opportunities to land ground strikes. Now, what they do so well is he does not waste punches. He usually will find one good shot and take it. He does not try to just go punch, 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 punch for the sake of punching. He finds position. He finds posture. He brings his hands inside, and then he comes over the top with elbows, or he lands these big right hands that makes his opponents fold up, and then he goes to the next position, whether it be submission or continuing to ground and pound his opponent into the bottom of the ox. And of course, it all starts with maintaining top position, which he does as well as anyone in the game. All right, here he is for my money, Mike, the most well-rounded fighter in this division, a true mixed martial artist at his core, and he believes he'll have a lot of advantages in this matchup. Tonight. Everyone talked about him being well-rounded. It's unbelievable to watch a guy that can do everything across the board at such a high level. Yeah, he's comfortable wherever the fight goes. Maybe he'll grapple tonight, maybe he'll strike. Makes him a hard guy to prepare for. specialist type of grappler in the UFC. This guy resembles him in a number of ways. Let's see how he manages this fight against a guy that can do just about everything inside the octagon. Well, perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by the jump. Really timing his shots nicely. Good tempo, very accurate, finding the range with relative ease. Yeah, he's doing a great job of really overwhelming his opponent with activity. All right, early round one, we'll see if he can use that jab and try to keep his opponent on the outside. Must be nice for these long fighters, huh? I mean, they are able to touch you as you try to enter into range. Tonight, he needs to use his jab, use his kicks to hit his opponent before his opponent can get into range to even start. Think about striking. What a punch. Ooh, head kick lands and he's hurt. Beautiful technique on the straight right hand. Oh! Big shots exchanged in the pocket there. All right, he'll engage in a single collar tie. Oh, Superman punch lands. Man, DC, his hands look good. A lot of volume, a lot of that. Oh, and he gets the takedown there. Too easy, Chip. Too easy. He has impeccable timing on these takedown attempts. And he landed the right hand there. Oh, big combination of ground and pound strikes here, DC. This could be the beginning of the end. I mean, you gotta be very careful when you take these big ground and pound strikes. You need a controlled posture on the bottom. And if you're the top guy, the guy that's looking to finish, continue to gain posture and bring down big strikes in your point. Oh, nice job here staying busy off of his back. Nice offense from the bottom. Back to his feet. And both guys really throwing with authority. That shot blocked by Felder. Keep your hands up. Just misses with the jab there. All right, he engages in a single collar tie here. The Korean Superboy gets absolutely punished by that head kick. The right hand just misses. by Choi. Just misses there with the left. Whiffs on that offering. Oh, he eats a knee there. That does not taste good. Well, he has certainly found the range and staying pretty busy here on the feet. He's being busy, but it's also the timing and the accuracy that's allowing him to land so many attacks lands the right hand. Look at how he turns his hip into that leg kick. Right Just missed with the left there. 
over and over, he's landed a big body kick. Oh, massive head kick there. We'll see if he can finish. Oh, nice job to land the straight punch there. Must be nice to have that kind of reach advantage, DC. I know you can't necessarily relate. I mean, look at the commitment to kicking. That's right. Back and forth we go. Wow. Actually got the takedown. All right, got to be careful playing around inside his guard. Absolutely, John. That's why you don't sit in a full guard. If you sit in a full guard, it gives these guys too many opportunities to chase submissions. And now he's jumping on a triangle. Cable inches right there, boy. Wow. It was a good night if that landed. Straight right, he misses. Effective strike there by the Korean Super Bowl. Unable to connect with the right hand there. Well, he's always working off of that jab. Nice jab there by Choi. Big shot to the head. Oh, and the Superman punch is good. Whiffs on the straight right hand. All right, so he lands a jab there. Pretty nicely done, DC. You could really control a fight just knowing how to fight a nice jab. Horn sounds for the end of round one. All right, now we check out some of the action from that previous round, DC. How about the display of striking? Just high level. I mean, you would think that we're watching a K-1 level kickboxing match opposed to being in the UFC. Both displayed great technical skills, unbelievable striking. All right, DC, second round is getting yeah, underway. Yeah, yeah. Round one, not the round of the year necessarily, but some good in there. And it's not always going to be. You have two very talented fighters. Sometimes it's very even. That's what we saw in round number one. Big punch lands over the top. How's he going to follow this one up? So he's really starting to put together some significant body shots here. These are going to take their toll as this fight goes on. Oh, man, this guy kicks like a mule. So hard. He kicks so hard every time you can see him drive his chin into his opponent. Yeah, he's fixed it all up. Oh, he lands that team. Big call for land. Now he gets back to range. of his size as he lands the knee. Oh! What a fantastic strike to throw at the exact right moment. Wow! Oh, heavy leg kick. Well, you saw us reference it in the tail of the tape, DC. He's got the reach advantage and certainly made good use of it there in landing that jab. Look at him whip his hip into that kick. Oh, that's a good right hand. And both fighters exchange in the pocket. Beautiful punch. Oh, look at him land another jab there. He's certainly using that weapon effectively here tonight. The most effective weapon in all of boxing, in all of combat sports, is a jab. This young man has a knowledge of using it like no one else. All right, so a near-perfect entry there, and finally he gets his first takedown of the fight, and they say, if at first you don't succeed, Try, try again, was able to get him down there. Persistence pays, and that's what we saw with this young man. Over and over, he shot for takedowns, he tried to fix it up, and he got offended. But eventually, he got it done. Now, what does he do with this top control? Oh, and he lands a punch there. Good connection by him on that. Great connect, so fast, so accurate. Watch the ability to land from anywhere. Man, as he landed a high volume of strikes here in round two, definitely picking up the pace after round one. So he got the message from the corner, and now he is taking control of this second round. Whoa! Oh, and he's back up again. Those get-ups have been there for him all night. Oh, straight right. Oh, and he connects there. Pretty nice punch there. 
great job fighting the range to land those punches. Back to the jab now, no good. Nice kick. Felder's lower jaw does not look good. I don't think it's broken, but starting to show some obvious signs of swell. That was a thudding leg kick. Oh, he lands another strike to the body, really starting to connect on a lot of shots to the midsection, and these will take their toll as this fight goes into the ladder rounds. Taken down now by Felder. Oh, he postured up there, gained some valuable separation. And now, the ground and pound starts. Lands a strike now from the bottom. Nice work there by the Korean Super Bowl. We approach the one minute mark here in the second round. By close guard now. You gotta be careful though, he's got a lot of submissions off his back. Oh, excellent pressure here from top position by Felder. Oh, nice job to reverse position on the ground. It was bad, but now it's not so bad. What a fantastic sweep. Oh, nice job working hard, posting, and getting back up. Good stick. Man, looks like he's trying to set records here, landing all of these strikes. He is a great... Oh! He's in trouble. He's hurt bad. Oh! Well, he's looking for that left hand. Just out of range, though, with it. Oh, big left hook there. All right, that's the end of round number two. Well, I'm not sure the extent to which he has recovered, but we do see the end of the round. DC, talk us through the replay. Well, he's a tough guy. He's going to make it to the stool. He's going to survive unless you put him completely out of there. Unfortunately, he's in there with a guy that does have that ability. All right, another round is now underway. Pretty good previous two rounds. We'll see who makes the requisite guys, adjustments now. The adjustments are going to be the key, John. When you're doing everything you're trained to do, and it stays this close, you got to really switch it up. Wood Corner was able to relay that message to their fighter better in between rounds. Oh, what a punch. Well, we talked about his reach advantage off the top. Made good use of it there with that punch, DC. Well, he hasn't really shown any signs of slowing down tonight. He continues to connect on a high volume of strikes here. Big kick lands. Oh! Huge right hand! Felder gets up again here, but he looks hurt. He didn't like that left hand. He needs to start looking to finish now because he's got his opponent hurt very bad. Oh, big left. Just misses with the straight right. Nice strike. All right, well, he's landed some good shots tonight, but there's no three-piece, there's no soda. More often than not, it's one and done. He's not even getting a combination. I mean, hey. if you're going to sit there at the drive thru <laughs> order a combination, take the soda with your food, give him the right hand behind the jab, give him the hook behind the right hand. Jab, right hand, hook, that's two pieces of chicken and a biscuit. Finish him off with the uppercut. That is your soda. I mean, come on, man, let this guy have the whole thing. Continues to mix it up, going to the head, mixing in some body shots. Right, Ooh, what a punch. Oh, nice. Oh, he goes to the counter right just out of range. Well, this is exactly the sense of urgency you're looking for. Try to take the judges out of it. He is lighting them up now. Oh, and he lands.
lands another knee there, DC. It doesn't always make you the taller fighter. In this instance, it most certainly did. Just misses with the left hook. And he lands a punch there. Pretty good connection by him. Great connection. He's in a great flow right now. He's got to be careful dipping his head when he's throwing that jab. Oh, just out of range with that punch attempt. into these big leg kicks. Oh! Big kick lands. All right, so he continues to land that patented jab and keeping his opponent at bay. You can know that it's coming, but until you're in there with him, the speed and the power of that jab is something you can't really prepare for. was just a gorgeous shot to end the fight right there. I'm not even sure the opponent really saw it coming. So back to the drawing board for him. But for the winner, this is certainly exactly what he was looking for here tonight. Well, another highlight for the real DC as we look back at that scintillating knockout. Yeah, but the whole fight, he was landing great strikes, kicks, punches. He was doing everything right until eventually he found the shot that ended the fight. So a strong candidate for some bonus money there. A huge knockout for him here tonight. Near perfect execution. They'll be talking about this result for some time. So there he is, the man of the...